your girl back for another video so i was watching some youtube videos and i came across some a new term that i've never heard before it's called man spreading so i watched a few videos on it and i found out that these crazy ass feminists have made up another term to um, divide the genders and piss men off and push men away even more and it's called again man spreading so basically what man spreading is is it's when like you're in a public place or like let's say you're on a bus and a man sitting there and you know how a man will kind of sit with his legs open just a little bit Apparently, this has pissed off the feminists. They're saying that men are being ignorant and arrogant and taking up space on purpose. And um, BuzzFeed did a video. I cannot stand BuzzFeed. But anyway, BuzzFeed had a few feminists that did this uh, uh, thing where they basically went out in public, sat on buses, sat in different public places, and opened their legs real wide to see you know, if people would react and they were just being assholes because like one of the girls was like this lesbian man bitch and she was sitting on the bus, you know, instead of just opening her legs a little bit, she had like one leg like this and one leg way out here like that. Like she was just being a complete asshole. Um, I think the whole experiment was stupid because honestly, once again, for the last freaking time, men and women are not equal. Men have something between their legs. That's why they open their legs when they sit. They cannot fold their legs like a woman does. Okay, ladies, you know how we have breasts? How would you feel if your breasts were between your legs? You would not be able to close them. That is just the only you know, thing I can think of to get you to understand. We are not equal to men. Men have you know, a different biological makeup than us. They have different genitals than we do. Well, so I'll be adult here. It's just ridiculous. They keep coming up with more and more ways to divide the genders and um, upset men, push men away, make men look bad, make up stupid shit about men. It's making all women look bad. Every woman watching this right now should be offended by this because what's happening is Men are getting fed up with the way women are. Ladies, if you're listening to this and you're single, this is going to affect you because men are getting to the point nowadays, they don't want to marry anymore. They don't want to have children as much anymore. They're scared to death to settle down with women because of what these feminists have done. You know, I did a couple men going their own way videos and you can just see in the comments, men are sick of women. They don't trust any freaking woman period not even their own mothers damn near you know men are just fed up and they have every right to be these feminists are destroying america they should not be dividing you know the genders we should be coming together we need fathers we need mothers both are essential to complete the family unit both are equally as important women are not more important than men and vice versa and we are not equal. I don't know how many times I have to say that. I'm sick of arguing with people. But I will continue to argue with, with, with people on this because it's the truth. We are not equal to men. We are not, okay? We are biologically different. We are not the same. We are not equal, okay? Both equally is important, but not equal, okay? Now, one thing that really gets me about this man-spreading baloney is the fact that these women are trying to say these men are taking up space because of their genitalia. Like, they cannot close their legs. Their genitals are in the way. Okay? Again, let's be adults here. But how many times have y'all been on a bus or a subway or somewhere in public and a freaking woman takes her big-ass, expensive-ass purse and sits it and takes up a seat? I see this all the time. When I was a little bit younger, I used to have to catch the bus everywhere. I didn't have a car. So... I experienced this firsthand. I would be standing up and women would be taking up spaces that I could have been sitting in because they they wanted their beloved coach bags and their beloved Michael Kors purses not touching the ground. Like that is complete bullshit. I remember being nine months pregnant with my son. Me and my husband went out to this uh, like jumping place to let our daughter jump and I needed a place to sit all these women were sitting down on their fat asses with with big ass purses taking up seats and nobody would move not one woman moved her purse so a nine-month pregnant woman can sit down 
That's how selfish these women are. That's how much they care about their expensive ass designer purses. But nobody's talking about that. They didn't make up a term for these stupid ass women taking up seats with their purses. Now, also, I've seen women take up uh, spaces on uh, buses with their shopping bags. I don't see men doing stuff like that. And to be honest with y'all, if it was a bunch of men sitting down at that place we went to, they would have got up to let the pregnant lady sit down. But it was all women. You know, they just sat there and stared at me. And I had to stand up because, God forbid, you know, one of their expensive purses touched the ground, you know. But this is getting completely out of control. And ladies, again, y'all should all be offended. Y'all should be fighting against this crap, fighting against feminism. It's it's ruining our society. It's chasing men away. And uh, it's just going to get worse from here. We have to stop this. So um, like the video if you did. Please subscribe and support me. And I'll see you back on my next video.